For the past six years, we have had the truly educational experience of working with the co-creator and showrunner of Schitt's Creek. Self-proclaimed handsome devil and international sex symbol, Dan Levy. Dan has had a, a hand in pretty much every aspect of production, from directing, to writing, to consulting on wardrobe, to eating my lunch, to playing our favorite disgruntled pelican, David Rose. Of course, I play his much younger sister, Alexis. Um, and I play his best friend, slash ex-lover, slash conscience, slash 33% um, of his thruple, Stevie. <laughs> And I play his uh, hyper-capable, unassumingly sexy partner in business and love, Patrick. You know, uh, working with Dan for the past several years, uh, we've watched him emerge as a leader for the entire industry in how to tell LGBTQ stories with normalcy, positivity, and respect. The relationship between Patrick and David has become a, a beacon of love and hope for people all over the world, and that is because Dan has expertly crafted an honest human connection between our characters that it's treated no different from all of the straight couples we've seen on TV over the years. It's just something that we don't see enough. Two LGBTQ people loving each other out loud without the shadow of hate and bigotry. And that's because from the start, Dan decided that there will be no homophobia in Schitt's Creek. It just doesn't exist. And I seriously get goosebumps every time just when I say that because it was such a maverick move. It, Dan has created so much more than a TV show. Schitt's Creek is pretty much this empathy factory. It's every day we get these letters from people who tell us things like, uh, your show helped me come out to my parents. Your, your show helped me accept my LGBTQ child. And honestly, it's like the biggest reward any of us can imagine. Um, an Emmy would have been nice, but, but this is better. <laughs> Our show is all about love. We feel it from the fans, we feel it, our characters feel it for each other, and in real life, we all dislike each other very much. <laughs> That's just a joke, Emily sexts me regularly. I do. <laughs> she never texts me back, not even a text. <laughs> My favorite thing um, on set is watching Dan's dad, Eugene, back at the monitors watching Dan and his sister Sarah act. Eugene gets this huge grin on his face and he starts mouthing their lines like a proud dance mom. <laughs> and he's just beaming with pride. Um, the love and acceptance that he feels for his kids is so apparent and it is so beautiful to watch. And it helps you understand where Dan's pride comes from and why he has chosen to pay it forward. We are so grateful to be friends and collaborators with somebody as incredible as Dan, who does so much to accelerate acceptance for the LGBTQ community.